Well, hello again, human beings from the planet Earth. What you see in front of you is my hammer, two iPods, and two nails. What you don't see is two children that have been disobedient continually recently. Uh, coming into teenage years, my oldest, Zachary, he's 13, Joseph, 12. Just disrespectful, disobedient, continually. They've been grounded and punished. iPods were taken. The youngest uh, seemed to learn his lesson because when I had enough of his grief, I smashed it. The other two don't get it, though, and I keep finding cigarette butts in their room. So we're going to help them break that habit. And, and they, they have been fully warned now. They've been grounded for about a week. They've been fully warned that if any cigarette butts or lighters or otherwise were found, that this would happen. And so I thought, for the sake of you parents who don't have enough balls to discipline your children and worry about their hurt feelings, just keep in mind that you must follow through. And these fucking iPods, I don't like them anyway. This, uh, all the stuff that you can do, they're unmonitored. Our kids are running around doing whatever the hell they want on the Internet. We have no idea. You're not taking the time to check it. I know you're not. Uh, so I'm going to recommend that everybody do the same thing. The first thing to go with any discipline is the electronics, the video games, the internet time, the iPods, the cell phones, the bullshit. So, here we go. We're going to, uh... oh, another thing we have here. They each have their own little piece of wood because this is going to be a memory for them. I'll put their names on the wood later on, but we're going to nail their iPods to the cross, so to speak, and uh, set a lesson that will hopefully last them a long, long time and uh, break any habits before they're formed. Sixteen penny spike. One iPod. Two iPods. Think little of it.